Hi, I'm Drew and I'm going to show you how to remove the background of an image in Paint 3D. Alright, so the first things you're going to need is a computer with Windows 10, an image that you're going to remove the background from, and a reset background that you're going to add in the back of the image. Right. So first, we're going to show you how to find Paint 3D. Now, I have it here, this little menu bar at the bottom of the screen. But if you don't, that's alright, because all you need to do is click here and type in Paint 3D. Find it, and click Open. Next, we need to import our image. So, when you're on the home screen, you click New. Then you go into your folder where you have your image, right click, scroll down to copy, you close this tab, right click again on the image and click paste. Here you have your image. So now you have your image here in Paint 3D, you're going to need to remove your background. You want to go up to the top and click magic select right here. Now. You're going to want to crop your image so that there's less background to remove and you can get a gist of where the target is. After you've done that, click next over here. And as you can see, your image is highlighted in blue um, and this is what's going to stay. Everything that is greyed out is going to be removed. Now, if there's something that is greyed out that you don't want to be, like here on my shoulder pad, you can see I want that part of the image. All you, you have to do is go up to the top and click Add or Remove. You can tell it's selected when it's blue. And you want to sort of draw a line over there. And there you go. Click Done. And you're out of the image. So now you're on a different layer from your background, but the original background is still here. So all you have to do to remove it, I click on it so you can move it around. And then click backspace, which is this button right here. And now it's gone. However, you're still too big for the original canvas. So what you're going to want to do is zoom in and shrink your image so that it fits the canvas. There we go. Alright, so now you're on the canvas to make the canvas a bit bigger. Just press this, these buttons at the top, click the plus button to zoom in, and now you're zoomed in. Right, I'm going to shrink this image a bit, so there's room for more stuff in the background. If you want to change the colour of the background, all you have to do is click the fill tool over here. Just left click on the image. You can change the colour down here. Let's say we want to make it red. You just click on the red one. And there you go. This works with all the colours. If you want an actual image as your background instead of just a plain colour, you can download one from Google Images. I have one saved to my folders here. All you have to do is find the image that you want, right click, go down to copy, go back in here and click paste. And here you have it. Now this image is a bit big for the character, so all you have to do is make the character a little bit bigger put him to the side and here you have it now that your image is finished if you want to save it go to the cross at the top of the screen left click it it's going to come up with these words do you want to save your work click save and click save in paint 3d after you've named your image 
it's gonna save it. Done. So if you want to find your work again, click on Paint 3D, click open, find your work, and there you go. It's gonna load the project. Sometimes it might take a while, but eventually, there you go. If you want to save your photos somewhere else on your computer rather than Paint 3D, all you have to do is click on your photo that we have here, go over to the top corner, click menu, then I want to click save as, click it image, here you can see the image that we have, and go to the top right and click JPEG. Go down the bottom to save, and here you have it. We're going to name it Me with the Eiffel Tower. Click save, and it's done. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Here are the things you can make with this Paint 3D. You could have yourself in a beautiful mountain range. You could have yourself in a movie location. You could even Photoshop you having a selfie with celebrities. Or you could put yourself in a movie. Have fun!